In this video, I'm going to show you how to use MetaTrader 5 platform to start trading on the financial market and potentially make money online. So here is what you are going to learn. So let's start off with how to download and install MetaTrader 5. To download and install MetaTrader 5, what you want to do is you want to go to Google and you want to type in MetaTrader 5. So if you type in MetaTrader 5 on Google, you are going to see that the first website that comes up is the MetaTrader 5 platform application. So you are going to go ahead and click on MetaTrader 5 app. Once you click that, you are going to land on this MetaTrader 5 website. There's a lot of things to read, but what you want to do is download MetaTrader 5 for Windows. If you are using Mac, you can download for Mac or Linux. Or if you are using it for your phone, you can check uh, on Google play store if you want to learn a step-by-step -step guide of how to use it on a phone i'll leave the video appearing on the corner of the screen right now so what i want to do here is i'll click on download metatrader 5 for windows i'll click that and you're going to see that this is going to be downloaded so i already have another metatrader 5 setup downloaded here so if i click on this setup you're going to be prompted to run this setup on your computer make sure you disable the firewall if you have firewall and then you're going to click or next and then you install metatrader 5 as you can see metatrader is being installed right now it will take a few minutes and a few of your data less than 100 megabytes i guess and then you are going to see congratulations we are waiting for you so metatrader has been downloaded so if i click finish here metatrader 5 is going to be opened on my uh, on my computer so right now i click finish and then i'm waiting for metatrader to be opened right so here is the uh opera mini uh this is metatrader explaining to you what you need to do so you can read this document that loads up right here but i'm just going to close this uh for now because i'm going to show you exactly what is in that document so just wait for metatrader to open it will take a little bit if it is the first time for you downloading it and installing it it will take you seconds but then it will open eventually okay so now this is metatrader and when it opens for the first time as you can see mine already have uh, a balance here this is because automatically connects uh, to my account because i already had metatrader installed so but then when you open it for the first time it's gonna look a little bit messy uh everywhere right so what you want is you want to close the strategy tester you click on this button right here right so you're just going to close here and then you can leave this and then also you can close the navigator click on this small x button right here close here and then you have these charts right here so i can close these charts and then i want to show you from a clean sheet how to do this so first of all you have what is called the market watch so what is the market watch the market watch is this part here where you see all the symbols and instruments that you are trading so for example here i'm connected to my derive account that's why you see these synthetic indices most of you might not be familiar with this but then if you want to learn more about synthetic indices you can check the link in the description below i will leave the link to the derive broker and then how you can start trading these synthetic indices you can also check on this channel we have a lot of videos about what are synthetic indices how they are being traded right so these indices have got a lot of movement so that's why i like i most likely want to trade them sometimes so check out the link in the description so first of all if you want to use another account right that have currencies and cryptocurrencies you can also do that with derive as i said but you can connect other brokers right so to connect the broker i'll show you in a minute but first of all uh when you go to market watch here you can see all the instruments that the broker allows you to trade if there is an instrument that you can't see here click on add and then i can type in for example jump index right so if i click jump index and i click enter you're going to see jump index is going to be added on my uh, watch list here right i can add anything that i want right for example i can add boom and crash uh 500 you can see if i click boom and crash 500 you're going to be added here and you can see it right here so this is the market watch this is where you get all the instruments that you want right so before you place a trade obviously on metatrader you want to be able to analyze the market right so how do you do this you go to any instruments that you want on your market watch for example volatility 10 index and then you right click and then you click on chart window and you're going to see this chart window coming up here so you can click on maximize here and then you have a bigger chart here or else you can click out and d on your computer 
or you can right click and then you click on dogged here out plus d if you do this you're going to get a big uh, screen here and you can maximize it to fit the bigger screen right but first before i show you how to use this chart you can see this chart is very ugly and these colors are not very friendly to most people right so i don't know why metatrader use this color as default but i want to show you how to change it so the first thing that you want to do is you want to right click and then you go to properties or you click f8 and you are going to see here you can change the colors and all how the chart looks like so i went on scheme here right just because i'm rushing and then i'm just gonna click color on white also note that you can change everything you can remove the grid you can click none make it smooth and then you can say bar up if you want to change it to another color maybe you want it to be in black and then you want bar down to be black also you want your bull candle to be very uh, lime green and maybe you want your beer candle to be a complete red uh, fire red and then uh, line chart you can change anything that you want and then you click ok now you can see i have a better screen here I had something that is a little bit better to look at right this is not going to change anything but this is just going to make this your experience with the charts a little bit better to use so here i can use this but then you will find out that if i go back i'll click out d and go back right if i go to another chart here for example step index and then i'll click on chart window you're going to see i'm going to get the the exact black and green which i don't want right so how do i change this i don't want to go back every time i open the chart so the next thing that i'm going to do is i can just open this and then i'll right click here so first of all what i want to do here is i want to go back to my favorite color here right i'm just going to go back and then i'm going to right click and click on templates and then i'm gonna i'm gonna click save template and then i'm gonna name this maybe my colors right and then i'm gonna save here so once i save this template the next thing that i do is if i open the chart here and it comes with the color that i don't want i'll just right click click on templates and then on templates here i'm just gonna see my colors here then you click here and now you can have this so i'm gonna go back out and out and d and then i'm just gonna go chart right here so i want to show you a few things right here that you want that you can use right so on this top bar here you can get different trading and analysis tools right for example if i do want to draw support and resistance i'll click this rectangle too and then i will just go where i want to draw it and then i'll just click and holding that click i'll just drag my mouse and then i can draw my support and resistance right i can also want to draw a trend line just come here to the trend line click the trend line and then you can draw anything that you want right so you click from where you want to come from to where you want to be and then you are going to get these tools right so these tools can help you to analyze the market i'm not going to go in depth with all of them but then they help you to analyze the market if you want to get the one two three move you can get it like this so a b c you can see this is my a b c so for the next thing that i'm looking for is for my d to be above right here right so these are all analysis tools that we can use i'm not gonna waste your time here but then you can also change from candlestick charts to bar charts also to learn charts as you can see if you want to use a line chart you can use it if you want to use a candlestick chart you can use it and then also you can take screenshots using this camera icon here and a lot of things that you can do uh with this platform right now the next thing that i'm going to show you is how to add indicators on this chart right so if you see on this chart right here you can see that there is a sign right here which is saying indicators you can see right here right i'll point this uh and then you click on on this end you are going to see different indicators for example there is trends you can see all the trend indicators there's oscillators you see all the oscillators indicators of volumes you can see bill williams uh custom indicators you are going to see all the custom indicators that you want for example if you want to add uh the cci you can click on cci and you are going to see something which looks like this and then you are going to click ok now you have your cci here if i want to add uh the moving average go to trend uh just search for moving averages change the period anything that you want to change here and then you're going to click ok now i have indicators on my charts and if i want to buy for example i would buy when the market 
comes below this 100 minus 100 line of the CCI and then goes over the 13 period moving average. I could buy here because this is a strategy, but I'm not talking about this strategy right now. Uh, we'll look at it uh, in another video. If you want to watch this strategy, make sure you tell me in the comments below. If you want me to show you this actual strategy, you can see again here, the market moves from the plus 100 of the CCI, goes below uh the 13 period and then we sell here and the market pushes to uh the downside so basically this is how you use the meta trader before we end up this you might be asking how do you connect your account to meta trader 5 so to connect your account to meta trader 5 you want to go to 5 you want to go to log in to trade account right you want to go to log in to trade account or you want to go to log into web trader so here i'm just going to go log into trade account if you already have an account with the broker just click on log into trade account and here you are going to put your login id and login password if you don't know where to find your login id a login password you can go to your broker for example if i go to my broker here and then i will just go into one of my accounts and get the login id so you log in to your broker's account if you want to learn how to create a derive account and connect it to metatrader 5 make sure like this video and tell me in the comments and i'll create a complete step-by-step -step guide on that right i also have another guide on this channel i will leave the link in the description but i'll do an updated version since the derive is updating also their website so you go to your broker and then you log in with your account and then you take in your log id you see it right here and then you go back to metatrader and then you put the login id you put the password right here select derive server here so there's a lot of servers here you are going to select your derive server right because as you can see uh, i have a lot of servers coming up here i have created accounts with a lot of brokers uh by the way uh by then i have the reef here and then i'll click the everything and click okay so my account is going to be logged in right so if you hear the sound your account is going to be logged in and you see the balance here and then if you don't have an account you go to file open an account and then you search for your broker here you can see there's a lot of brokers you can search any broker that is able to connect uh with with this right so for example for me as i said i would select derive as my broker and then once i do this i will go and click next once i click next i'm going to either open a demo account and open a real account or connect an existing account so for example if i wanted a demo account i'll click create a demo account and then i'll just add to i just have to add my email address name and surname and phone number and then i'll create my account just like that it's very very easy this is the meta trader app before you go let me show you how to place your trades right so let's say you are seeing this and you are expecting prices to drop to the downside right so i'm just gonna enlarge this so that you can see so let's say for example here i'm expecting prices to go to the downside what do i do here what i'm looking to do here is to sell so to sell there's two ways you can see on this top corner here they say show panel if i click this i will go i'm going to go get this drop down where you can put your lot size here and place your trades or else i can just come here and then i will click new order right here you can see click here new order and then once you click new order you are going to get this pop up here on the volume you put your lot size for example here i can put 0 0.10 you can put your stop losses here if you want right so on this one i will put 84.95 as my stop loss 8495 is my stop loss and then my take profit i can put let's say 8452 so if you don't know where i'm getting these numbers i'm looking at the chart right here so i will sell right I, once i sell you can see that i have my trade right here click out d and you can see this is my trade this is my sell order this is my stop loss this is my take profits right you can see that here on my trade right you can see i have a trade which is open which have minus 10 cents in loss right now 10 cents in profit 20 cents uh going like that right so this is not uh, a trade that i'm gonna stay a long time in because this is just an example but this is exactly how you place your trades you can also adjust your stop loss and take profits by just clicking on the take profit for example 
uh, dragging it below if you want to make it big you can drag it closer if you want to make it very small which i am not recommending you to do do not do this right so as, as, as you can see i have the trade the stop loss and the take profits this is exactly how you use metatrader 5 as a beginner but then i didn't go in depth in everything here i was just making you familiar with the platform if you want a step-by-step -step guide on how to start trading how to analyze the market how to make money in the market i will leave a link in the description for a free trading course for beginners make sure you check it out and i will see you in the next video if you also want to get free whatsapp setups and signals i will leave the link again in the description so don't leave this video without checking the description i will see you in the next one thank you